Now we're getting to some really challenging aspects of being human. And then everything that happened to me, anything that created shame, anything that put me in danger, any failure, my central nervous system is like, you don't want to do that again. And you failed miserably and everybody was laughing at you. So the memory bank is there and your central nervous system does not want you to take any risks because then it has to work. I'm relatively lazy. The central nervous system is relatively lazy, but the amygdala and the anxiety and the fear is a workaholic. Now we're getting into some really challenging aspects of being human. What you're saying is the central nervous system is constantly evaluating me for familiarity and security. It's looking at my surroundings all the time. Self-preservation and survival, priority number one. Taking risks, never. I don't want to take risks. I want to be a creature of habit. I want to make this very easy for me. Then the amygdala, the fear center, the anxiety, the worry, the stress, the anticipation, the agitation, that's a workaholic. So your amygdala is always like, hey, look over there in the corner. Maybe that guy wants to jump you. So it's a profound challenge for us. None of us know this. We're not taught any of things of how our brain works. But in certain situations, such as trauma, the physiological changes impact our behavioral pattern 